Hey guys, <clears throat> and today we're going to be making um, what I call the ultimate jig trailer. Uh, it's going to be a black and a blue summer crawl because I know the most white color of a jig probably these days is more than likely either a pumpkin or you know a black and a blue. Black and a blue being my personal favorite. So I figured I'd make y'all up a uh, very, very nice looking jig trailer just to show y'all and give y'all a look of it. But here, uh, Calhoun medium. I'm going to get this little mix up. Go ahead and uh, get us a batch going here. I'm going to go about half a cup. Uh, always mix your plastic up before you do anything with it or eat it or anything like that. Then back so I'm going to go ahead and uh, put my secret, my little formula to add to all my plastic. have a little formula that I do to every batch of my plastic or I normally try them. Sometimes I forget and I just drop that top in there of course. Only on video would I do that. So I'm just going to set that aside and I'm going to clean that top off in a little bit. But uh, anyway, let's throw that all up. And then I'm actually going to add, I'm going to add a little bit of um, hog and anise or much crawl and garlic scent since this is a crawl bait. Add a little bit to that. This stuff does smell pretty bad, but I'm sure the fish like it. Mix that up. Mix it up nice and slow, guys. Now we're going to put this in there. We're going to go two minutes. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and. Uh, I'm not going to make a fresh batch of black because I'm running kind of low on plastic sauce. So we're just going to, we're going to cut a little bit of this old black up. So the first thing that I'll do is I'll add a little bit of uh, Caney Creek Crystal Clear Heat Stabilizer. And uh, I'm not going to add my special formula to this plastic just because it is a reheated and so it's already been added to it. Or I would. I only add my new formula to fresh batches just because you know if it's an old batch it's already been in there so we're gonna cut this up and the little the little of the hunk the better of course just you know, common sense it'll melt faster but it also so we're almost about done cutting this up and uh, while we're waiting on this to uh, heat up I'm gonna go ahead and feature the brand new colors ocean and glitter supreme so this here is our ocean color. It's a light blue with light blue and a little bit of dark blue and a tiny touch of purple flake. I wish this camera could zoom, but it can't. I mean, I wish it could focus, but it can't. And there it is. You can really see that green glitter, that uh, on, uh, uh, light blue glitter really sparkling. And now this is the color that a bunch of people really liked, and it's the glitter supreme color. Oh, it's a clear bait. It just has a lot of glitter, and that bait really shines in the water and catches those fish's attention. We've already caught fish on this color, so definitely a killer color, guys. Um, if y'all want to make an order, guys, just you know, go make an order. Uh, go follow us on Instagram. You know, go follow us on Instagram. S underscore P underscore Bait Co. You know, uh, like us on Facebook. We're gonna be doing a giveaway here in a few days. I'm still trying to decide on what I want to give away. I have an idea or two in my head, but still trying to figure out what I want to give away. But um, anyway, guys, 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 needs to go for about 30 more seconds. Then we'll make our nice blue color up. But um, anyway, guys, like I said, you we're gonna have a website up here hopefully next week or the week after that. It's getting worked on. It's going to look good. It's going to be nice. All of our products, all of our colors, everything like that will be on there. So, y'all, make sure y'all stay tuned for that. And I'll let y'all know when that's out, of course, and y'all can make purchases a lot easier. But even though, anyway, if you don't, if we, even though we don't have the website, you know, I, I'll, there's ways to give me your order, guys. You know, go to email me at smpbakeco at gmail.com or go. Uh, get our Instagram page, like I said earlier, S underscore P underscore Baitco. Just, um, 
contact me in a comment in the comment box, and I'll be sure I'll get guys. I'll I'll get your comments. Don't worry. I respond to. I try to respond to all my contacts. I mean, uh, comments. So um, yeah. So I'll get I'll get it, guys. Oh way, I'm uh, adding some uh, X2 colorant, Tiny Creek, and that'll really turn that bait into a nice vibrant blue. I'm gonna add a one or two more drops. Just really make that blue pop. There it is. Now I'm actually gonna add a little bit of um, hyper highlights, blue pearl. Gonna add a little bit of that. A little highlight gives it a long way. Put a little bit more than that. Not that much. Alright, so that color, and while we're doing this, we're going to get our black heated up. Alright. So, color, I don't know how me and this color do, but when I add two drops of color, and it gets everywhere. I don't know how. This color will be ready to inject right after another little stir. And that really adds that makes it look glossy. It's just a great looking blue. Get y'all up close on that. Really nice blue. Alright guys, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, inject this color so it can be cool when my that black's heating up. Uh bears baits, four and a half ounce. Uh, hand injector, just suck up some plastic, place it directly in the nozzle, and it's just constant pressure until that bait fills up. I'm shining my gloves. Until you feel it stop, I always top off the sprue, empty the rest of the excess plastic back into here. Then all you gotta do is simply pop that sprue off. There's your bait. But um, like I said, guys, we're gonna be having uh, our website should be up next week. And that'll be a big addition to our company. But uh, yeah, guys, so make sure y'all stay tuned for that. And uh, just right now, uh, just go hit that subscribe button and go on ahead and hit that thumbs up button, guys. Do that for me. Do this for this company. And uh, you don't know, y'all don't really know how much unless you do make videos. That, that like helps so much. I'm sure y'all just like, oh, it's just like, man, calm down. But a like goes a long ways, guys. And a comment goes a long way. And so does the subscribe. So just anything helps. Um, but ask me any questions in the comment box. You know, ask me anything you want. Um, try to respond to every comment. So, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll see your comment and I will reply to it, guys. I promise. I'm going to get that ejector cleaned off and ready to go. It looks like that black is all the way heated up. So we're going to go ahead and finish this. Oh, I got to, oh, what are you doing, Preston? You got to, while I'm waiting on this, I think that's ready to go ahead and be taken out of the mold. And there it is, guys. Uh, now, to get this double color down, very simple. You just place everything where it needs to be. Then simply take your nice sharp pair of scissors. I said sharp, but it meant to say sharp. Lift up the body and just cut right along the body and cut that claw off. And then the next side, do the same exact thing. Get right next to the body cavity and just cut that claw directly off. So that leaves you with just a body. Then you have two claws on the mold. And now we're going to go ahead and inject this rest of this bait after we get it closed up, of course. Alright, give it one last stir to get some of that glitter to the top. The flake goes a long way in these baits. I like to use less color and more flake to really make the bait shine and pop. Alright, so we're going to finish injecting this bait. There 
we go. Dump out the excess plastic. Really, really hot too. Then always, like I said, just pop this screw. There you go, guys. So anyway, uh, this bait's drying. I'm sure y'all already knew that, but got literally junk everywhere. I'm just gonna kind of clean this tape a little bit. Set that on the window sill. Set that on the window. I'm just gonna try to get this liquid dust off this table. I just don't like having that messy table with that glitter and junk everywhere. I like having a nice, clean, dry table. But um, anyway, guys. Um, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, like this video. You know, subscribe. You know, uh, make sure you go like us on Facebook and follow us on Insta Instagram. Instagram's probably. I probably post five or six pictures a day of new stuff coming to this uh, uh, website and all that. I know a lot of y'all probably have Instagram, and I know a lot of y'all probably follow me on Instagram. Uh, the link is S underscore P underscore Bait Co. And um, that's how mostly I get most of my orders and stuff. That's how the, probably the easiest way to contact me, unless you just do it right down here in the contact in the comment box. I can, I'll definitely get those too. But um, anyway, guys, this bait should be about ready. It's going to be about 10 seconds. So, but um, I'm going to mention this glitter supreme color again. Here it is. All that is is a. Uh, there's actually no colorant added, and you can see the main glitter in there is the most glitter you notice is probably the orange and the red. But um, this is probably ocean blue it's a really light blue really really nice I like that it's like a lot I add that to most of my bait it's like that's pretty much the making of this ocean color you see all that light blue shining but uh, anyway starting to rack up this is probably a five pound box and this is just my scrap box mostly blue up and blue down there from all these crawls that I've been making trailers and stuff that I've been selling and shipping out Alright, so this bait should be about ready to take out of the mold here. Feels that it is. So I'm going to take that out. It looks nice. I ran the plastic plastic to go through there a little too much, but nothing wrong with that. We can always trim that off. One second, guys, while I trim this little excess piece off. There it is, guys. The ultimate Jeep truck. The summer crawl. You know, it's a really, really nice Jeep trailer, guys. But um, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, uh, make sure you go hit that like button right now. Go subscribe, comment, anything, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Um, hope to see an order from you in the future. Thanks, guys. Till next time.